There's an estimation of somewhere around $250 billion that may fraudulently go out the door. Well, in tonight's Waste Watch investigation, it is your money, and it's being given away by the federal government to the wrong people through Obamacare. That's right. Millions of applicants to the new health care exchanges are lying about what they make each year to get benefits that they're not eligible for. Fox 17's Erica Curry says they can because Uncle Sam has no way to verify the answers in real time. That's right, Scott. Americans are only supposed to receive the benefits based on income and if their employer doesn't provide the coverage. And right now, the only plan to verify income is a potential audit later by the Health and Human Services. And it said that we would no longer have them verify their income, the applicant, but they could just self-attest, um, in other words, using the honesty system. Congressman Diane Black says it's in the writing of the law. One of the two major qualifications for the Affordable Care Act had its verification waived last summer. There's no way for Health and Human Services to check applications against IRS income data before giving away taxpayers' subsidies to those who apply. It's a shame. It's really a shame. Terry Bossa is touring downtown Nashville from Louisiana. Traveling is how she and her husband would rather have their money.